We start in Western New York where the Bills and Steelers clash in a battle of Super Bowl contenders. COVID is no different than just an average cold as Beasley caught everything. Deontay Johnson and Johnson gave the Steelers a boost as Big Pharma Roethlisberger threaded the needle to his wide receiver for a score. The game changed on a big play in the second half, and speaking of a hack getting blocked, no one is able to see Michael Rappaport's tweets anymore. <laughs> you sick, you fuck. sick fuck. Here we go. Steelers, here, here we, we go. go. Pittsburgh's going to the Super Bowl. Steelers, 23. Bill 16. What? What? Some spread. We head to Cincinnati versus Minnesota. Two cities known for being very chilly. As we mourn the passing of Joe Burrow, the giraffe. And in a touching tribute to our sweet prince, the human Joe Burrow had the zookeepers playing neck as he connected with Jamar Chase for 101 yards and a touchdown. In a garden of feeling, Adam was the first man in the end zone, but Minnesota came up short as seven minutes and Evan McPherson went into the closet with his sister, but didn't kiss her, stopping us all from witnessing a tie. The Bengals 27, the Vikings 24. What? What? To Nash Vegas, where four Chandler Jones trolled the Titans' backfield all afternoon long with five sacks. Chris Kyler Murray delivered a kill shot with four touchdowns and over 300 yards. Kirk was a good Christian, unlike Ryan Satan Hill. As for the Titans' offensive line, well, they had Taylor Le wah, 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 wah. Just wanted on the record, we're still for the boys. Cardinals 38, Titans 13. Whoop, whoop. Down the road to Atlanta as Jalen Hurts so good. Arthur Smith stinks, we knew that he would, cause Jalen Hurts so good. Eagles quarterback Jalen Hurts was on fire Sunday, hitting his tight end, Zach Hurts so good. Yeah baby, make it hurt so good. Arthur Smith stinks, we knew that he would, cause Zach Hurts so good. Javon Cougar Mellencamp had two sacks, and look at those bald eagles fly. Ain't that America? Little ditty about Matthew Ryan. Just American kid doing the best that he can. But it looks like the thrill Levin is gone for the Falcons. Eagles, 32. The Falcons, 6. Two birds. Two birds. Two birds. One cup. One stone. In Detroit, Trey Lance pass came out onto the field when the offense wasn't in sync to throw his first career pass, which was also a touchdown. Tim Debo Samuel did his best impression of a Mets outfielder, dropping an easy ball late in the fourth, keeping the Lions' hope for a win alive. Dan DeLion Campbell had his team fighting until the end, and we'll have to wait another week until we give him his Trey Flowers. Niners, 41, Lions, 33. Uh, 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 in Indianapolis, where Olivia Rodrigo Blankenship said the kick is up and it's good for you. Carson Wentz finally had his cast away, but still let Wilson get away as the first half MVP was added again with four touchdowns. Chris Carson had Pleat Carroll wearing his best pair of sideline khakis. And speaking of straight lines, DK Metcalf ran a couple routes and scored a touchdown. Seahawks 28, the Colts. 16. I'm going to have to tag you on that one, Teach. Oh. In Raul John, Justin Herbert Hoover sent Washington fans into a Great Depression as J.P. Morgan Chase Young isn't too big to fail after all. Terry Schiavo McLaurin showed signs of life, but Brandon Staley said, Hey, can I borrow this outlet for my Chargers? Too soon, boom. Dying Fitzpatrick hit his life alert after taking a fall and hurting his hip. And as a fan of football in general, let's hope he's okay. The San Diego Superchargers 20, Washington football team 16. And we drive through Tuscaloosa North, where we'll take a Big Mac and two of cheeseburgers with some Admiral Nelson Aguilar. And don't worry, there might be a little dust on the waddle, but Brian Flores' tenure is getting sweeter with time. And speaking of time, Bill Belichick starts his 47th straight season coaching in the NFL. 47 years ago, we both had hair teeth. A lot more hair, boo. The student becomes a teacher as Flores and the Dolphins take down the hoodie and let me be the first to wish Julian Edelman a happy Yom Kippur from the couch as it was clear without him, the New England Patriots weren't fast enough. Dolphins 17, the Patriots 16. 
Standing on a corner, Jameis Winston down in Nola. Such a fine sight to finally see. He's finally back, leading the Saints attack. Looking slim and throwing five TDs. You haven't learned your lesson. Rogers looks depressing. Your job's in jeopardy, answer in the form of a question. Saints 38, Packers 3. And we finish in Kansas City, where you can find me in the tub. Battle for a dub, as two quarterbacks makes 50 cent. Astroglide Edward Zelaire slipped through all the holes, and the Kool-Aid man Andy Reid unleashed Chris Jonestown, and the Brown special teams had Cleveland fans everywhere killing themselves as they couldn't get a Guyana Chiefs receiver. The Chiefs come back for a huge win, 33-29. Oh, 